Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Last week I covered a brief, very brief introduction to Canva, the free um, software that lives on the internet so you can access it anywhere in the world. All you need is an internet connection, it's completely free and it's got huge library of templates um, suitable for social media, um, presentations, resume or um, getting your business cards or logos done or uh, social media banners those are very common and it occurred to me that I need to include something that allows you to differentiate your products your logo um, from the standard template that's already included so I wanted to share with you a few um, resources that I personally love um, the first one is Pixabay and it's P-I-X-A-B-A-Y dot com Pixabay um, you can get photos, illustrations and vectors personally I haven't used videos or music so I can't comment on those but um, I know for sure there are a huge number of um, images that you can get so photos or vectors or um, you know something that will suit what you're trying to accomplish for your business. So that's Pixabay. The next one I wanted to cover was Unsplash. Unsplash is, uh, as it says, freely usable images. And it's uploaded by, you know, similar to Pixabay, it's uploaded by people who contribute. Um, now, Unsplash is mostly pictures, uh, sorry, photos. So people take photos of their cameras and they upload it for you to use <laughs> completely free um, obviously you can donate um, and you can check out the website um, to see if they have anything that's suitable for what you are trying to accomplish for your business or um, social media purposes um, but definitely check out Unsplash now those first two were Unsplash and Pixabay these two are free images um, and pictures sites uh, which you can add um, before I cover the next two, if you do enjoy the content, smash that thumbs up button, drop a comment, let me know what you think. Um, the next two resources I wanted to share were uh, font related. So when you get your um, standard templates from Canva, which are, which are great by the way, um, and you can always play around with what Canva has to offer you may decide actually you want something a little different you may want a different font that is not on Canva so maybe a dancing strip for um, a dance school you know um, you know just just take a look um, at this and you may have to buy the commercial license if, if you see something that you really want it's free for personal use but not for commercial use so that's something to be aware of so that's 1001 free fonts and finally it's font squirrel now font squirrel um, they've got a lot of fonts and they're all free uh, for commercial use as well some of them you will download directly on their website fontsquirrel.com or they may direct you to a different website and that's how they um, get all their free fonts I guess someone at Font Squirrel is actively looking for uh, free fonts to uh, pass on to their uh, customers like, like you and I. Um, now again, take a look and see what suits your purposes. Um, obviously you, you probably need to match it to what you're trying to accomplish with the templates that you're using in, in Canva. Um, but play around with it and have fun with it. So, you know, Pixabay, Unsplash, 1001 free fonts and font squirrel that's plenty to get you started um, I hope you enjoy the video please subscribe and I will see you on the next video